Hi there, Gail here from the Tibido Branch, and today I'd like to take you on a choose your own kitchen adventure where we take a look at healthy and delicious fresh garlic. Now this is a choose your own adventure, so we'll look at several different options and you can pick the best that works for you and your family. First quest, let's peel some garlic. Take a fresh head and break it into individual cloves. Then, for the first option, we'll use the bench scraper method. This is where you take something firm and flat and use it to give the garlic a good whack. Twist and the skin should peel right off. Option two is my preferred method. It's a silicone garlic peeler. Pop in a clove, give it a roll, and the skin comes right off. Easy peasy. For the second quest, we'll look at different ways we can cut garlic. Option one, good old fashioned cutting board and knife. Now, we'll use this as if we were cutting an onion. First, we'll make some vertical slices long ways, leaving about an eighth an inch at the top where the stem is uncut. Then, we'll do a few horizontal cuts. This will turn those slices into strips. And finally, let's cut across those strips and we'll end up with little cubes of garlic. trim around the stem for any usable bits, and then let's put this aside. We'll use it later in a bonus quest. Option two, the small grater. They have this setting on the box grater if you don't have a handheld one like this. My personal favorite, just put the pointy side down and go back and forth, easy peasy. Again, let's save the stem ends for a side quest later. Just like that, grated garlic. Third option, a mandolin, of course, with a safety glove. Now mandolins are adjustable, so go ahead and put it on its thinnest setting. Put on your safety glove, this will protect your fingers. And just like with the grater, we're gonna go pointy side down and run through so we have uniform slices of garlic. Perfect. Now option four is by four the easiest method of quest two. It's of course the handy dandy garlic press. Now this has a little basket. This is where your clove goes. Take a clove or two, cut off the stem, pop it in the basket and press away. Easy as that. And there you have quest two. We have whole garlic, diced garlic, grated garlic, sliced garlic, and pressed garlic. Perfect for all your needs. And if you prefer to keep garlic in your fridge, like the kind you buy in the store, just go ahead and do a couple of heads of garlic at a time. Put it in a sealed container and use it throughout your week. For the third quest of our kitchen adventure, let's see a few ways that we can use this garlic. The first option would be a simple saute. Just add a little bit of butter, oil, or fat to a pan, melt it, and then toss in your garlic. Cook it over low heat until nice and fragrant, about 30 seconds. For a more decadent option, let's make some roasted garlic. Preheat your oven to 400 degrees. In a small baking dish with an oven safe lid, put your garlic, oil, salt, and pepper. Mix well, cover, and bake for 25 to 35 minutes. When it comes out, it should be caramelized, sweet, and delicious. Perfect toppings for pizza or on a charcuterie board. I hope you enjoyed this kitchen adventure. Remember, using fresh garlic is as easy as choosing your favorite method to peel, cut, and cook. Now, it's time for that bonus quest. Remember the ends of garlic we've been putting aside throughout this video? Well, go ahead and toss those in a container that you keep in your freezer. Whenever you cook, add in your scraps of onions, garlic, vegetables, and bones. Then, when you have a full bag, 
Drop these into a slow cooker. Cover with water. Cook on low overnight. When you wake up in the morning, you'll have a delicious stock that you can strain and use throughout your week.